Hey guys, what's up? So in today's video, I wanna talk about Carnival Cruise. Ticker symbol is CCL. Now this is obviously a cruise line stock that's been beaten down uh, quite a lot this past year. It's gone from around $50 a share all the way down to $13 a share. Now I'm not looking at Carnival Cruise to invest in the long term, but in this video, I wanna talk about a trade that I've been thinking I wanna do with Carnival Cruise. I'll be using call options with this trade, but if you're not into option trading, you can just buy the shares directly. It would work either way. So yeah, this isn't a full in-depth look at Carnival Cruise, but this is a quick trade that I'm looking at over the next couple of months that could bring massive returns if things work out the way I think they might. So the reason why I'm looking at Carnival Cruise and doing a trade on it is because of the vaccine possibly coming out by the end of this year. Now there's a lot of information on this. There's articles constantly coming out, but I actually was listening to an interview that I can't remember where I saw this interview, but it's a Wall Street guy who is an analyst on all the vaccine companies. And he was saying that he's pretty much positive that a vaccine is going to be announced in the next two weeks. So him and his firm are under the belief that a vaccine is going to be announced and this is gonna cause Carnival Cruise to skyrocket in its share price. So that's the basis behind this trade. And there's actually a site that shows us uh, at what stage a lot of these vaccines are at. And you can see here, there's a lot of vaccines in phase three. Now phase three is for human trials. So they're at the very end of their testing and this could take anywhere from one month to a few months. Um, so it's really realistic that if one of these actually succeeds that we could see it in the next two weeks or two months. And as you can probably understand, the cruise lines are being beaten down and can't recover because of the health crisis that's going on right now. As long as the health crisis is going on, people aren't gonna be allowed to go on these cruise ships and their business is eventually gonna go bankrupt. In fact, when I was listening to this Wall Street analyst, he actually said that he believes Carnival Cruise is gonna go bankrupt by around May of 2021. So he does not believe in Carnival Cruise long-term and I don't believe in it either. I think that this company and a lot of the cruise lines are really gonna struggle with all the debt they've taken on and I don't think it's gonna be possible for them to get to that 100% occupancy rate for quite a while. So yeah, I'm not bullish on the long term of these stocks, but there could be a really good trade opportunity with some big catalyst events coming up like the vaccine announcement. It was actually just announced, I think a couple of days ago where the cruise lines have been suspended till the end of the year. And I anticipate without a vaccine, they're just gonna keep on getting suspended probably up until summertime. So it's really important for these cruises that they actually do get a vaccine out there. So yeah, I just wanna make it crystal clear. I am not looking at the cruise lines as a long-term investment, but there is a trade opportunity here. So let me explain what kind of trade opportunity there is and what my plan is with this. So I plan on using call options. You could just buy the stock directly like what I said earlier, but because I'm not bullish on this stock long-term, I really don't wanna hold it anyways. And by using a call option, I can make a ton more money in a short period of time. And that's really what I'm just looking at. So I'm looking at call options for January 15th, 2021, because I'm hoping that the vaccines announced between now and this time. And I really don't wanna hold Carnival Cruise for longer than that anyways. And the strike price that I'm thinking about doing is either $15 or $17. So I'm gonna show you some examples of what kind of money you can make by uh, doing the $15 strike price. Okay, so I'm just on a option calculator here, uh, ticker symbol CCL, the current price is $13. We have the January calls here, and um, I'm doing 35 contracts times 100, so it's about $5,000, 4,900. And then I'm gonna show you guys a graph between 11 and $35. So yeah, I'm thinking about doing around three to $5,000 in this trade. I was thinking about doing 10 grand, but yeah, I'm not exactly that confident in the vaccine. So by limiting myself to $5,000, I feel like it's a much better risk first reward for myself. That's just my financial situation. And so if we look here, this is the graph that I have. At the top is the dates. I'm gonna hope that a vaccine's announced by let's say December 26th. So we're gonna look at a few different prices at uh, December 26 to see what kind of money we could potentially make here. So let's say if a vaccine's announced and their stock price shoots up to $17. Now keep in mind, $17 really isn't that much of an increase from a vaccine being announced. I actually anticipate 
that uh, Carnival Cruise would probably double or even triple in price on news like that. But let's start with $17. So if the share price managed to get to $17, which I definitely think it would have no problem doing, you would make $4,300 on this trade. So you'd almost double your money by just having the share price go up $4. But of course we anticipate that it would actually go up a lot more than that. So let's step it up to $24 a share. So that's almost a doubling in its share price, not quite, but if it did manage to get to $24 a share, you would make $24,000. Now that's a lot of money by just investing about five grand, you would make 500% on your investment. Uh, this is the kind of risk versus reward that I like. And seeing how many vaccines are in their final phase and a few different analysts and people even like Donald Trump, not that I uh, really believe what Donald Trump says all the time, but he did say in a conference that he believed that the vaccine would be done by the end of the year. Uh, so it's worth noting at least. Um, but yeah, anyways, at $24, you would 5X your money. But I think there'd be a good chance that it could go higher. So let's look at $30. Now this is where things get really crazy. At $30 a share, you would 10X your money. From $5,000 investment, you would come out with $50,000 in profits. And that's realistically where I think this talk could actually get to. So yeah, just insane gains to be made here if this, if this trade actually goes successful. And then if we wanna look at a super bullish case where I really don't think it could ever go higher than this on a vaccine announcement, uh, but that would be $34. And at $34 a share, you would make $63,000. Um, and this would probably be best case scenario in my mind, but it wouldn't be totally unrealistic if it did actually get to $34. If you remember where Carnival Cruise was trading before the health crisis, it was trading at $50 a share. Um, now, I, I don't really think that the vaccine would bounce it all the way to $50 a share, but you never know, it could. So just for the fun of it, let's see how much money you would make if it went back to its share price of $50 a share, and you would make $115,000. Now, I really don't actually think this is possible in a two month time for it to go up to $50 a share, uh, but just for the fun of it, this would be the possibility if it went back to its pre-health crisis level. Yeah, so anyways guys, this was a video just to update you on what I'm thinking and a trade that I'm really considering doing right now. Uh, my exact plan is to wait the rest of the week out. I don't wanna buy any stocks this week. I told myself I wouldn't. So at the end of this week, I'm gonna reevaluate. I'm gonna look at Carnival Cruise stock, see where it's trading at. I'm gonna take a look at how the vaccines are developing. And if everything looks good, I'm probably going to initiate this trade. And I'll make sure to do a video on that to update you guys. But uh, let me know in the comments down below what you think of this trade. And are you invested in Carnival Cruise or thinking about it? I'm really curious to know what you guys are thinking and uh, make sure to drop a like on the video if you found this informative or interesting or you just appreciated the content. Uh, it really helps with the channel a lot. And yeah, thanks for watching till the end guys. I upload stock videos almost every day of the week. So feel free to subscribe if you want to see more interesting content. And yeah, don't forget to comment down below. Let me know what you think of this trade, if it's a good or bad idea. And I'll see you guys on the next video.